Hello guys, so let's explore most useful Spotify keyboard shortcuts. So Spotify can be much more faster and easier to use when you know some of these basic keyboard shortcuts. So let's just explore some of them and which are more popular and can be useful for you. So if you want to create a new playlist on a Mac, it's just Command N. So if you press Command N, you will see something like this. This is a new playlist. If you want to copy a URL of the track, you can just use command C on Mac. So for example, I can just copy this track and when I want to insert it, it will appear as link to this Spotify track. Obviously you can delete your tracks this way. Also you can use command A to select all tracks. So this one is really useful. For example, you can select all tracks here and then just move them to another playlist. And this way you can just merge two playlists. So you can just select all tracks from one playlist and move them to another. So after you selected all the songs, just right click and then you can add to new playlist and do different stuff. So obviously uh, to play pause, one of the most useful shortcuts you just use space, both on Mac and on Windows. So if my track is selected, I just press space and then it just stops. So it's really useful for Spotify desktop app. Repeat on Mac command R, on Windows control R and a shuffle command S. So you don't need to go to your desktop app, you can just press command S and the song, songs will shuffle. So something like this. And as you can see, the shuffling was enabled. I can disable it here. So next track on Windows is easy, control right. On Mac is just control command right or control command left. Volume up, command up uh, with the arrow command down. And this one mute is useful, command shift down. So as you can see, as I'm playing some song, I can just press uh, command shift down or command shift up to disable mute. Yep, and command shift up on Mac is a maximum volume. If you want to filter songs on Spotify, you can use command F. So it's really useful if you have huge playlists, just press command F on Mac and you can just filter by title or something like that. Then if you want to access preferences, it's really easy, command, comma. You can really fast access settings. To log out active user, command, shift, W, control, shift, W, quit, command, quit. Then uh, hide window, command, H. So I'm just pressing command, H and the Spotify window has been hide, hidden. To close the window, command W, minimize window, command M. So I'm just pressing command M and Spotify on Mac will appear in the bottom right corner. So it's the difference between minimizing and hiding the window. To restore from minimized, you need to press command Alt 1. So command alt one and here is Spotify again. So yep, that's about it guys. These are just the most common keyboard shortcuts. They're pretty similar both on Mac and Windows. However, some are only available from Mac here in the bottom. But otherwise I can save you a lot of time if you are a Spotify junkie. So thanks for watching and hope to see you in the next videos.